What's up Trophy Hunter, welcome to another quick Trophy and Achievement Guide. This time we take a quick look at Rick Henderson. What is the game? Rick Henderson is an endless horizontal scrolling shoot em up game. The game will be available on August 31 for 8 dollars. And yes, the game is cross by, so basically you can get two platinums. First of all, if you like shoot em ups, you will definitely love this one. Each playthrough is different and it never gets boring and the soundtrack is pretty cool too. Trophy wise the game is very straightforward and there are no missable trophies. The game requires a bit of skill because you need to finish at least one loop. This means you need to finish 6 levels. After that the game will restart with loop 2 level 1. So first of all I recommend just focus on completing one loop. This will already unlock the majority of the trophies. The game also has a rank system and you need to attain the kernel rank. You need to fill up the rank bar to get one rank. This can be done by collecting gems and ranks. Getting the kernel rank must be done in a single playthrough. But usually you should get this automatically after completing the first loop. There are also plenty of miscellaneous trophies but they are just a matter of time. For example collect 150 gems or kill 2500 enemies and so on. These trophies are cumulative so you don't have to do this in a single playthrough. The only trophies which must be done in a single playthrough is attaining the kernel rank and finishing one loop. After defeating a boss you can choose between four different upgrades. They are always random so each playthrough will be different. You have only one life and there are no continues so if you die you have to start from the beginning of the game. There is no way to regain health during a level. You only get your health back after completing a level. All in one I had some fun with the game but there are four annoying trophies. And these trophies are the reason why this game takes so long. During a playthrough some random events can happen. There are four different events and you need to enter each event three times. And this can take very long. There is an upgrade in the game called Jinxed, which allows you a higher chance to encounter a random event. I recommend whenever you see this upgrade, take it. Well, one of the fastest way to grind for these events is start a new game and play until level 2. If no event happens in level 2, start the game again. I think it's not possible that an event can happen in level 1. Because with this method it took me one and a half hours to get the event trophies and I never got the event in level 1. So I guess they only can happen at the second level. Well, to the randomness in the game, it's possible that you get the events a lot quicker than me. If an event happens, you can see it on the top of the screen. Usually it always happens at the start of a new level. So one more time in short, complete at least one loop and try to attain the kernel rank. Once done, just try to get the event trophies because all the other trophies will unlock along the way. Don't get me wrong, the game is a very good shoot em up and I really liked it. But unfortunately the event trophies are so annoying. You will probably have unlocked all the trophies within 2 hours except the event trophies. And I almost forgot it, there is an in-game tutorial. Usually I skip always the tutorials but I recommend play through it, it will definitely help you. So guys this is basically all you need to know about the game. I hope you found this video useful, thanks for the attention, see you in my next one.